I put out the thing. We're looking for a new head of um, Barcelona Outdoors. I'm serious about that. So that's still on the table, the 700 people who applied that's still open? 100% on the table. Oh, I got yeah. people lined up to take this job. I am very much going to look if I think a girl can do it better than he can, and I'll fucking hire him. I'm going to do what I think is for Barcel Sports. What's up guys, I'm Sydney Wells with Barstool Outdoors and I cannot believe that 2021 is coming to an end. These past 10 months has been incredible. We've been on so many adventures this past 10 months from fishing to bow fishing to getting in a helicopter for the very first time, chasing after alligator to whitetail deer. It has been an insane journey. And that being said, I just wanna say thank you so much to everybody back at Barstool Sports, all the fans, all the stoolies for watching our videos, for commenting and just being very, very supportive. Also, big shout out to Rocky Boots for being our presenting sponsor this year and seeing all the apparel and gear we need to make this happen. So, let's go ahead and take a look back at 2021. Average, What's the biggest average biggest fish you've ever caught? Alligator gar, I think I was like 11. And it was like 227 pounds. Yeah, Gigantor. Not a hermit crab. <laughs> yeah, I know, I was like, you know, one time you I caught- He lost his shell and I cried. One, one time I really did, I caught something like, that's the bait you got. Talk about a fish! Holy crap! YouTube, so we caught a couple thousand fish tonight. Fishing up! My first King Salmon! Welcome to Mossy Oak Oak Buildings are downtown West Point, Mississippi, home of Brandon Walker, by the way. Barstool's one and only. Very exciting because I'm with Cuz and I'm excited to be on his podcast, Fistful of Dirt, today. I call them stoolies. You don't do that if you're old, and you just, you just follow them. So I'm not a stoolie, but I'm a fan. So Barstool Sports, Dave Portnoy is the president of right. Barstool Sports. I followed him for a long time, so I'm not trying to yeah. toot his horn. It's like he was the most honest guy ever. Tell you how it is, tell you what he thought, tell you if he was wrong. And I was always laughing. I'm like, oh my gosh, did you guys see what Dave Portnoy said? Him and then Erica Nardini is our CEO, who is a bad to the bone. Check. I've made a living out of summing people up really quick, and I can tell that you absolutely love it. Okay, boys, here we go. I jumped in the helicopter with Ryan Ashcraft, and we covered miles of farmland hunting for these hogs. It wasn't long before we spotted a few in the brush. Buddy, I got two picks on my, my uh, 9 o'clock. Hold on, I'm going to come back down on them. I'm going right. to I'm gonna push them to behind me. Hold on, so they're, they're mixed in with those cattle. Good shot. You already got a piece. Hold on one second, hold on one second. Put right here. Good oh, shot, God. front flip. Hell yeah. Yeah, it's crazy the damage they do out here. And a lot of people don't even understand how damaging they are to other animals. Nah, outside looking in, all everybody sees is a social media post of us killing them or something, but they don't really understand the true reason behind it until they're a farmer. Oh yeah, nice shot. Uh, get, one, get those two spotted, one's left across that fence. Uh, 
Oh, shot, headshot. Okay, so Sydney from? Illinois. Nice. Yeah. And outdoors person. So I was born and raised to, you know, do anything when it comes to outdoors. Fishing, bow fishing. Love it. If you put a ten ring on a snake head, that's where it would be. Woo! Dude, that's a record guard right there. Big guard. You're gonna watch out for their teeth. Slice your hand right open. This guy is a stone. We did it, dude! We did it! What up, Sydney? I said, fresh from the fucking, I don't know, forest or wherever you were hunting. (laughs) Yeah, (laughs) sorry, I was late. I was like running to my apartment. Out of curiosity, how many mounts do y'all have in the family home? Uh, probably a couple hundred. What? <laughs> what we I thought you were going to say like 12. Yeah. <laughs> Look at my head. Look at this head. Gigantic. We'll kill you. We'll charge at you with no fear in their eyes. Tell us about that experience, uh, Sydney. I feel like Dave is ready to drop everything in his life and go be a, a professional hunter or whatever. Yeah, I think he actually is. You're a deer within a mile radius of me you fucked up this is like a far cry from what he was saying 48 it's, hours it's, ago. it's a total flip i want that thing's head on a steak game of their own style and i will force chief to look at it i'm basically chris kyle with a gun was dave actually good or um i mean yeah he was pretty good we like shot shotguns at like clay pigeons he did really good You gotta get it at the peak because it's just kind of sitting there a little bit. Cheap is better with the archery, so now like Dave wants a gun now. Cheap wants to buy a bow. Oh yeah! But yeah, Dave's like all for it. So it's cheap. Like they're both like, this is the best thing that's ever happened to me. <gasps> Look at that, Dave. Dave is a great deer. I, I, when she was like, it's a doe, I was like, a little baby doe, and you fucking <laughs> killed it. We did it. That's your first year. My first year. No, it's a big one. Get down next to me. If anybody's listening in, like, Texas, you want to go hunt, like, fucking gazelles in Africa, I'm in. <laughs> I'm in. So I'm going to go with the crocodile, the Nile crocodile in Africa. So they're 10 times more powerful than a great white shark. Ooh. And they can apply 5,000 pounds of pressure per square inch. What? You know and they're so much more aggress- aggressive than an alligator. Like, yeah. they're, they're, they will hunt and kill you. Like, yeah. What's your like favorite outdoors activity? Bow hunting, 110 percent. Bye, Brandon.
What did you think of Brandon not holding the door for you? I was 15 feet in front of the girl. We were in a little tussle about it, but it's fine now. I didn't know she was coming out. I, she was behind me. Brandon's a scumbag skill. Sorry, Brandon. West Point has a new star in town. <laughs> What's happening? That's Brandon Walker's pond. Literally, it looks like a piece of blood. <laughs> what is this? This is Miss Ray, Brandon Walker's mother. It's me, it's me. The door shut in front of my face. I didn't think that's But I, I don't know. Girl, you can come get here anytime. You stay with me. Not a good look, bud. Okay. Welcome to the Brandon Walker smoking room. I am here in Brandon Walker's hometown at his pond that I am stealing in his fishing pool and his mom. Suck it, Brandon. Uh,